Hello, Sunshine and Steph, and I am obsessed with freelancing and content creation and teaching you all how to turn your own passions into paid gigs online. I'm a Sunshine State turned Arizona dog mom and wife who left corporate PT due to burnouts to pursue my own passions. Things like fitness, dogs, being on camera, and tapping into my creative side. And now I work from home full time, running a six figure business online freelancing. And here on YouTube, where you are, I teach you guys how to craft a side hustle that you love. Because when you love what you do, it never truly feels like work. So thank you for being here. Give a little tap on that subscribe button below if you want to learn how to build a side hustle this year so you can stay up to date on when new videos come out for you. As always, if you find this video helpful, I'd also appreciate a thumbs up, comment, show me some love today, all right? So today, we have an exciting video lineup all about freelancing for those of you guys who want to achieve five or success in 2023. I've got three tips for you on how to do that. I'm going to share with you three really valuable tips that will help you boost your sales, grow your business, and help you stand out from the crowd. So let's jump right into it, all right? Here we go. Tip number one for Fiverr success in 2023 is stay plugged in to updates directly from Fiverr. Okay. Fiverr, they're constantly evolving and introducing new features to improve their platform for both buyers and sellers. So to make sure that you're taking full advantage of every new opportunity that comes your way, it's essential that you stay up to date. And here's how you can do that. Number one, you can follow Fiverr on Instagram. By following their official Instagram account, you'll get these regular updates on their posts and stories. You'll get sneak peeks. You'll get valuable insights onto what's coming up for them. Okay. Another thing, I really have been enjoying attending some of their live webinars as well. They bring in celebrities and these really amazing entrepreneurs to speak on panels with them. And the reason I find out about those to sign up for those free webinars is because I follow them on Instagram. On their Instagram stories, they're sharing when there's new live events coming up. And if they're free, they send, they share the little link of how you can sign up for these free webinars. So just the other week, week, Barbara from Shark Tank was on one of the panels with other Fiverr guests. Pretty cool, huh? So follow Fiverr everywhere. It's always going to be valuable information. They don't flood you with too much. It's just enough to keep you up to date on what's fresh and new. Another way you can stay up to date with Fiverr is by reading their press releases. They occasionally will put out statements to announce really significant updates to the platform. So you can keep an eye out on those press releases on their website to make sure you know of any changes that could impact your gigs. All right. And one more. Another way, they do put out blog posts. If you are old school and you still like reading blog posts like I do, you can check out their blog posts. Like once a week, they seem to put them out with some really great topics. I'm loving them. I'm a big examples girl, so I don't want to just tell you this and not give you examples. So here's an example. Earlier this year, they launched that they're going to now be adding welcome videos to your profile. So when people land on your Fiverr profile, which is essentially your resume on there, they can see a little one minute welcome video of you saying, hi, welcome to my Fiverr page. This is who I am. This is what I do, right? So it's no longer videos just on every gig that you have, but you can now have one welcome video on your profile. Another new feature they launched this year is that you can sell consultations or 30, 60 minute little video consults like a Zoom call, being the expert in whatever field you are directly from your Fiverr profile as well. All right, moving on to tip number two for Fiverr success in 2023 is to hire a mentor to ensure that you have consistent sales and business growth. Having a mentor can provide you with a lot of valuable guidance, insights, and also fresh perspectives to get a new set of eyes on your gigs. And here's what you can do. 
with a mentor, you can assess your analytics. Your, your mentor can really help you dive deep into your analytics and understand what's working and what's not. It's nice to have someone else's perspective. And by analyzing those numbers of your gig performance, you can identify what areas you may need to improve or optimize to make your gigs better. A mentor can also help compare your prices and services to your competitors. They can help you research and analyze the competition to ensure that your prices and services are competitive and also attractive to bring new potential buyers in. And this analysis will really help you position yourself effectively in the marketplace. Okay. Another reason a mentor is great is they can help you optimize your gigs. What this means is they can help you with making some specific improvements to get more eyes on your gigs. The third thing a mentor can help you with is optimizing your gigs, making these very small little detailed changes that may help you get better visibility and conversion on your gigs. They can guide you in writing out your gig descriptions better, choosing better keyword tags, maybe changing out the pictures. They have a better perspective because they see a lot of other people's gigs so they can know what's working and what's not. And they can provide you with that insight and outsider perspective of exactly what to change, right? So for example, I'm not just hopping on here saying, all right, I'm a Fiverr freelance mentor. You guys have to hire me now. I'm not saying that. I practice what I preach. I have my own mentor. I meet with him once a month. He has given me a lot of valuable perspective. Things that I think look okay, he's like, well, Stephanie, one of your closest competitors actually packages it this way. One of your closest competitors actually uses this keyword, and this keyword is actually trending right now. He can see things from a different perspective and look at the numbers in a less emotional way. Whereas for me, I kind of like feel like I'm just kind of like stuck. Like I already know what's in the gig. I feel like it's okay. But he is a fresh set of eyes to look at things from a more business analytical perspective, right? He doesn't have any like fancy magical power. It's just nice to have a mentor, someone who has the experience, has the expertise and can look at things for, for you in a different perspective. And so that is why I pay every single month for my own fiber mentor. All right, so I'm coming on here to say, yes, I am a fiber freelance mentor. Even if I, someone who is already a successful six-figure freelancer, needs a mentor, I think everyone needs a mentor. I really do. Anything related to business, a mentor is never going to hurt you. They're always going to help you propel your business forward quicker and more efficiently. All right, so you guys, we're staying plugged in with Fiverr. We are making sure we have that mentor to optimize everything. So let's move on to our third tip for today to finding Fiverr success in 2023. Last but not least, tip number three is consider promoting your gigs. While Fiverr does provide exposure to your gigs when you show up on search results, promoting them can give you a little extra boost to show up even higher on search results, right? So here are some ways that you can promote your own gigs. You can do this, number one, on your own social media. You can leverage the power of social media platforms to really showcase your own gigs and attract buyers in. Share your gigs on your own platforms, like your Facebook, your Twitter, your LinkedIn, your Instagram, so that people will click on it, see your gigs more often, you'll get more reach and more engagement on them. You can also do your own paid advertising where you pay to promote your gig to a larger audience on Fiverr.com. So you can invest in having a sponsored gig where basically the platform increases your visibility. It says, okay, instead of you showing up on page three, showing up on page one. So you're going to get a lot more views and therefore if your gig picture and title look good, you'll get a lot more clicks and potentially more conversions into to paid clients, okay? So you can promote for free on your own social media wherever you want, or you can pay to be promoted directly on fiverr.com. Besides those two options, free and paid, keep in mind another way to increase your reach is just to collaborate with other friends, network, be partners with brands and businesses. So maybe they share your stuff elsewhere. For example, if you are doing videos as an influencer, make sure that when that brand shares your video that they're tagging you. So you show up not only on your own Instagram and TikTok, but when they share it, they're also 
tagging you. So now you're getting a bigger reach because you're showing up on theirs. So remember that when you're negotiating your deals, that not only will you create the video and post it on your own Instagram as an influencer, but negotiate in that the brand shares that video for you, that they either become a collaborator on the post and then can share it on all of their platforms, but make sure you negotiate in that they will actually like tag you so that you get more exposure. So you're not only getting these free products now to try as a creator, you're getting paid to make these videos, you're getting paid to post as an influencer, but now you're also going to get free exposure if you negotiate into your deal that they will you know, shout you out on their own pages as well. So check out those gig promotions on fiverr.com. You can't promote all of your gigs. They have to meet a certain requirement in order to be promotable, but it will show you which ones you're allowed to promote. And over time, the more orders you get, the more reviews, then more of your gigs will become eligible for promotion. All right, that's a wrap, folks. I hope that you found those three tips for Fiverr success in 2023 super helpful super informative. I'm currently recording this in May 2023. So we have seven more months. Is that right? Yeah. Seven more months of the year to really make our gig shine, to really utilize all the new features that are coming up on Fiverr, to really make sure that we are growing. Because if you're not growing, you're dying. This is a phrase, I don't know who said that, but it, I'm always reminding myself this, if you're not growing, you're dying. And so I always keep that in mind when I meet with my mentor each month. Hey, these gigs are growing, but this specific one is not growing, which in my mind means it's dying. So what do we need to do to optimize it right now, right? So really take a look at those analytics regularly. Stay on top of it. Keep track of them. I have a spreadsheet where I keep track of all of my gigs every month, all of the analytics and what changes I've made to test out and see if they work. This is a spreadsheet I share with my students in the Freelancer Academy, but it's just a really great way to make sure that you're continuing to grow. All right. So I hope that you guys liked this video. If you did, give me a comment. I really, really, really love them. And that's a wrap. Thanks for being here.